You need a financial advisor with the freedom to focus on your specific needs. Whatever your goals, Reed Potter can create a game plan tailored to you. Call Reed at 432-0777 at Pikeville, Kentucky to learn more. Mountain Motor Complex, formerly known as Mountain Motor Speedway, is under new management following the July flooding. The complex will feature not only a dirt track, but a new motocross course and a drag strip for the 2023 racing season. Me, my background is I've had a facility in South Carolina. I'm a motor, like I said, I'm a motocross guy. I had a 300 acre facility in South Carolina that really boomed. It was called Motivated. And uh, it got, the land got sold out from under me. So when I had to move, we went to Greenville and tried it again, just didn't work out. So I come back home and I was putting on races over here at the uh, fairgrounds, over here at Isom Fairgrounds. And after the flood, I believe somebody just, they just said they didn't want to fool with it no more. So they left. So I said, okay, that's an opportunity. So in the middle of the track, you can obviously see we got jumps in there. So we got the dirt bikes in the middle of the track. So we are trying that. That's a new thing we're doing. We have completely resurfaced the car track, try to make it a little bit better, a little more racing, take some of the old well-known bumps out of it. So we are also, we are doing the drag strip as well. We also have a 330 foot drag strip. And if I'm not mistaken, they say it's the sketchiest drag strip in the country. So, I mean, that's a, that's a good, that's a plus. You know what I mean? In my book. Mountain Motor Complex originally opened in 1968 and is believed to be the oldest operational dirt track in Kentucky. It's, it's very important. For one, it brings in tourism, which brings in money for the local economy. But it gives people here something to do. And this track has, like, since 1968, it's been here. And families, like, kids have grown up here, and they brought their kids, and then their kids has brought theirs, and it's a family event, and it, it's, it's in their blood. And it's, it's an important thing to be able to offer them something that they love, because you can keep them home. You can keep your money home instead of sending it out to another county or another state. Adams hopes to improve seating, concessions, and add more events as the season progresses. We want to be, we want to be the premier facility. We are working on it. We are working on a, uh, we're not working with a whole lot of money. We are working with a lot of our gut and a lot of good friends, and we have a lot of good friends that have actually helped us out. To me, it, it's a different standard. Uh, I want to, I want to live up to, if not better than what the people, previous people have done. And to do that, we're gonna have to make a few changes. So, and we feel like we're making those changes. We are far from done. We are definitely trying to make a better seating. And what it does to me, this is, this is home to me. You know what I mean? I was in South Carolina, I've done a lot of other stuff too, but this is home. So this means more to me, as, uh, I guess spiritual, not just that, just like I, this is my home. And I've got, I feel like I have to live to a different standard here. People are gonna hold me to a different standard. So I'm gonna try to keep this track at a higher standard than it's ever been before. Okay. For more information and to see upcoming events, go to Mountain Motor Complex on Facebook. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.